Taxpayers' dollars are used to inspect our nation's bridges every two years. Current inspection methods are manual and subjective, they create unnecessary lane closures, create accidents on the bridge due to the use of heavy equipment, and are not mandated to use the latest technologies or inspection methods to keep our bridges, inspectors and traveling public safe. Here is an example of a cable state bridge. Inspections of the cables take place every two years by closing the bridge lane. Costs money, causes accidents, causes traffic and people late to work. Parking a bucket truck and sending an inspector up at height to look at one side of a cable. Puts inspector at risk. The bucket truck frequently hits the cable due to high winds, damaging the cable. The inspector is looking at the HTPE sheathing, which protects the steel cables that actually holds up the bridge. The steel cables are inside, these are never inspected. So why spend taxpayer dollars, inspecting something that is nothing but a protective coating? Well in the 19th century the only way to inspect a cable state bridge cable was visually. Infrastructure Preservation Corporation Robotic Cable Scan changed that 10 years ago with the introduction of a robotic cable state bridge inspection service. This portable lightweight unit robotically climbs a bridge cable, taking video of 360 degrees of the exterior while conducting an MRI of the interior steel, locating loss of metallic area and broken wires in 360 degrees of the cable with no lane closures or heavy equipment required. No danger to the traveling public or inspectors, no traffic delays. Shins, shins, shins.